so the accidental tourist or accidental tourist the writer is an american writer and he is a best selling author also because he writes in a very comic manner in a very funny manner humorous manner and he has written in english language and on the english also he has written in science also he has written many means his subject is not restricted to any single thing and he could able to write in english because he uh, was or he is in britain for certain time that means he is both american and english man he writes in a, in a funny manner and also his uh, writings they are very acclaimed for in many ways and he received a widespread recognition again with the publication of a short history of nearly everything see the name itself it is a very funny thing history means when we hear about must be those kings and the princes and all these things and the war and again no he has put the title history of on everything nearly everything because everything has an history what we say is if it is a pen the pen has a history how it has come into existence where this cap is made and where this pointer is made when this where this is made or when this body is made what is to be put what is required right totally how much it costs and why we have to use this that itself is the history so he is well known for his the short history of nearly everything written and published in 2003 and which popularized scientific questions for a general audience it contained many scientific questions you can watch nowadays in the tv how it is made even your slippers they show how they are made and the nib fountain pen nib refill how they are made or the bullets how they are made they will show very clearly and what are to be taken now how the mission runs all these things they put it how they are packed and how they are been sent to the market this all we can see there so he is famous for his writings because his books are humorous what is his name william mac mac is not m a c or m a c m c and we should not put it m c we are to read it mac so william mac girl and he is well known as bill as bill and he is bryson that is his name now what he has to say about the travel is there are many people why we do not understand what why do they travel first they don't have any plan and i know certain people i know they were to go to visakhapatnam and they board a train bound to mumbai they are supposed to go to visakhapatnam and they board the train which is bound to mumbai because that is also called konark and this is also called konark and pathetically at visakhapatnam these two konark up and down trains they stand one is on platform number 1 the other is platform number 2 and the announcer calls konark express is ready to leave from platform number 2 konark express because he gives every detail the konark express from mumbai to bhubaneswar is ready to leave from platform number 2 but our traveler he listens that much only because that he wanted that much konark express is on the platform number 2 he goes sits 
settles everything ready and the person one who possesses that seat in which our great gentleman sits he must have gone for some some uh, recreation or something must be going for a cigarette or something he must have gone down and you know when the train moves in the plat on the platform the person who had got down he will not be coming to his place back he will be just watching out as if he is missing something standing at the door and when the train catches speed at one or two stations he would come back sir agriculture sir he questions the person who sits over there or he says it is my seat sir na it is mine probably up to vishakhapatnam it is yours but it is mine now i got reserved ticket this gentleman doesn't show it and this gentleman doesn't ask it both will be sitting of course there is a space let me sit let the conductor come that way he simply agrees and sits and the train reaches vijay vijayanagaram the train reaches vijayanagaram and it stops briefly there then our gentleman who boards the train he doesn't have any other thing he will not see he will be in his own thoughts something just leg on leg and he will be moving the legs and etc i will be thinking somewhere he will be somewhere and when the train passes vijayanagaram the conductor comes and he checks the ticket sir mere ekkalal sir nenu park pune yellali aithe pune yelthe ee train ekke rent sir ha konark ekke nu pune yellal kada konark ekke nu e konark sir this is down konark sir not up konark sir ha is it how sir vijayanagar velli vijayanagar vellinda that kind of an traveler or tourist is accidental tourist i told some example here but here the writer has brought many things happening with one single person and that person narrates it to you see the fun he is a clumsy traveler clumsy tourist and he puts his travel log through his mouth he tells it narrates it very nice no and we can really enjoy his travel let us enjoy they say that the world today is a small place because travel has become easy but not everybody finds it easy to travel you see a travel easy and padal patko chetla tippadu chudandi ittu adu tippadu that is called writer skill they say that the world today is a small place because travel has become easy at the same moment he puts a controversial statement again but not everybody finds it easy to travel so here the author reflects humorously his experience as a traveler 